but no. Good morning, afternoon or evening. What is up? My name is Maarten. That is Ilona. Welcome to the vlog. Welcome to Volus Vibes. Welcome to a late start of the day. An ex special day. An ex special day? Hi, Jason. Ha. Yeah. It's yeah. nice weather outside, eh? Yes. Ha. Hoo-ha! I'm Jason. Uh, uh, there's still a little bit of snow on top of the mountain. Well, I point up there, but I want to point here. Climb over the middle. Cl climb. Climb. <laughs> I mean, uh, yeah, it's a little bit parked close to the wall here. It is the 2nd of April. Yesterday, the 1st of April, we didn't vlog. <laughs> Just kidding. No, really, actually, we didn't <laughs> vlog. So that also means that I did not take off my Martis yet. Kalomina to everybody, which means in Greek, good month. You wish everybody a good month at the beginning of the month. The month starts better because my zits, that have been very obvious the couple of days, are not visible anymore. <laughs> you and your zits. Well, I have them. This Martis is something that I've been wearing the entire month of March and uh, I did it because Jason Ilona, it the first day. Exactly. The one Ilona all the time uh, Ilona's all the time got ripped off by Jason. Jason ripped off his own all the time and was like eating it, so not for little babies. Are you almost done with putting him in his chair? Yeah, but this is loose like I said last time. I have to drive the car forward first so Ilona can get into the car as well. I hate it when people oh. Then you put a car in gear, that would also help. Hey. Sesame open. Yes. It feels somehow luxurious if you have this gate that opens for you. And it feels safe, but half of the time it's just standing open anyway. I don't know why, but electric gates seemingly break very often and fast, so this one does not always close, sadly enough. That's okay, our car is dusty and dirty. We've got a couple of things to do, but you see that in a second. Meanwhile, check out how these little guys chill on his bed. Not bad in his car seat. He's sitting there so nicely, just grabbing his belt. We got a comment that it's not safe to put Jason with his jacket in the car seat, so we have the jacket next to us, just in case no need it, but it's a very nice day. Right? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I want to say, first we have to visit our local dealer, but... Lissula <laughs> says we have him on the right, wrong side of the car. Yeah, I agree with her though. Move away from the vehicle. <laughs> Hi boy. Hi boy. Yeah. <laughs> You got your drugs? Yes. Okay. Ilona needed some uh, vitamins for her after her pregnancy, actually, because she breastfeeds, she needs a lot of vitamins, so, right? And when I say our local dealer, Dardula, Prisula Dardula, of course, mean our pharmacist. It's just a joke, people. You understand that I help, right? I took something tasty. My parents took from the Netherlands Stroopwafels. I love them. Wait, you're not allowed to have them? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I need to clean the car. But you're not allowed to have them, are you? I am. We're, ce we're, gonna test it. we're celebrating. Ilona can have um, some first milk again. For the ones who didn't know, Jason has or had a uh, milk allergy. Ilona is breastfeeding, so Ilona could not eat milk stuff as well. I wouldn't expect it for most things, of course, cookies of, uh, it is, but here it is literally written creamy butter, milk, uh, caramelized sugar, some powder from milk also. So in general, in a lot of things is milk. Even in? Sausages. Sausages and, and chicken and tuna and all those kind of things. So now it's also the time of Nistissimo because of like the, the fast that people do after, until Easter, right? I say correctly, right? Nistissimo. Yeah. Okay. Nistia. Nistia, Nistissimo. Yeah, so they have a lot of Nistissimo food. Even at Zagroplastia. And uh, we know someone that has a Zagroplastia. When you speak of the devil, I actually was looking for you. 
Ladies and gentlemen, this is Chris. He owns with his brother Venetia Neonia. Look at these people. I love it. We're gonna eat this one. We're gonna eat this one once. Not now. Once. I want to challenge some people with this one. Yeah, you can try some now again. Huh? Challenge. 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 You have to You must be so happy to be able to eat this again. <laughs> Very nice and soft. Amygdala, almonds, um, sugar. I know this, I know this because we put it in bread. Uh, how do you call it? Walnuts? No, no, no. no almonds. Only almonds. Scared of almonds. <laughs> Look at all this tasty stuff, people. <laughs> So this is ice cream, you've got stracciatella, I think? Uh, cookies. Cookies? Cookies, it's not stracciatella, it's Oreo with Oreo. Oreo cookies. I'm putting another one because it's going to be too much for, too much for you, I It's going to be, I, I will be fine. You want to try it? No, no, no. Oh, you're not allowed yet. Ice cream. Uh, Homemade. <laughs> oh, Jason, you want a bite? <laughs> <laughs> So good. Oh, okay, you also took a little bit, a bit of the ice cream, of course. One little bite, right? Because you've been careful for almost six months right now? Four months. Four months. Four months you've not been eating anything with milk. And now we're here and you're being peace. So bad. <laughs> but uh, we're gonna take some of this because this is also very normal to eat right now, right? No, baklava is not. Only baklava, right? Only baklava. Calabal Okay, well, I want to take the baklava, yes, but I also want to take some of what you just gave us before for to give away. This is with coconut and it's, it has a lot of uh, it has a lot of choices. Yeah. And for most of your foreigners out there, you probably know what baklava is. Only you you will find out that when you're in Greece and you eat real baklava from Zagreb Plastil, it's nothing compared to what you get as a dessert in like a restaurant, for example, because they're pre-packaged a lot of times. In most restaurants, they don't might make uh, baklava themselves. Did you know that? Most restaurants in the Netherlands they order it from uh, a big company. There's a wholesale company, and they import it from a wholesale company here in Greece. Most of them. But it's literally, it's phyllo, but it's like, it's so much drenched in, the, this one still has crunch to it. it. You can see still that this is phyllo. The other one that you have in the Netherlands, for example, it is so soaking wet that it, you can eat it with a spoon almost. Yeah. yeah, I forgot to mention, Chris just says it, but the, or, officially the origin of baklava, baklava. <laughs> is not even Greek, it's Turkish. <laughs> but if you tell most Greeks though, they say like, no, 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 it's yes. Greek. Yes. And also the, the the Turkish the original Turkish baklava it has also the the green peanuts inside the Guinness peanut uh, pistache exactly ah. exactly if you go to Turkey and you order baklava it's gonna have only pistache but a little bit on, on top or just no all. no no inside everywhere everywhere the green one we, is, we need to go to Turkey <laughs> yeah it's a really different flavor but it's also very expensive this, right. the specific uh, peanut. well you can you can get pistache from Greece as well I mean we have a we have an address where we get amygdala and pistache right. Order again. <laughs> we, last time we got a kilo of uh, amygdala, almonds, that is, by the way. Yeah, they can from 10 euros. Where in the supermarket you pay 18 euros per, per kilo. So I'm very happy about that. We're a little bit cheapskate sometimes. <laughs> Thanks again, Chris. Uh, like the uh, yeah, yeah, we have uh, Yeah, we have the extra right now with us. Look what we just took. Like a little gift, but a lot of like gifts also from Chris. So whenever you're in Neonia, whenever you drive by Venetia, the funny thing is that uh, the Chris's mom just said that it's very nice when the baby falls asleep in your hands, but Jason is nine and a half kilos. So nine and a half kilos and holding it all the time. He needs, he needs you know what right they now. say, when a baby sleeps or whenever, whenever a, pers a person sleeps, it becomes a bit more heavier. Oh yeah, but uh, because, because it's, you know, it really hang, is, yeah. yeah. Like when we're drunk, for example, I become heavier. Yeah, exactly, well. <laughs> exactly, exactly, exactly. We're going to see you some on the next place. I wanted to go home, but not yet. 
because I want this car super dirty after we visited Platanada last time and I love this new washing thing that we have here. I have to be a little bit quiet. I don't know if I'm gonna wake up Jason, but probably... Nah, he's nicely sleeping. Ilona's gonna film from the inside because uh, I've gotta do my job of cleaning the car. So you're gonna see it from the inside, okay? like an image of how the rims were before but these rims they were black of all the dust of braking and everything so uh, yeah looks good again uh, still needs to dry off but we're gonna go home because you're also not allowed to dry it off here Jason is uh, needs to eat huh? I know there's another program Ilona's trying to tell me that there's another program and this is like to dry it off but in all honesty, I know out of experience that this does not really work and it just gives you stains. I just used a little bit this one with a little bit of wax. Because the wax makes the car like gives a protective layer. Anyway, time to go home. Ilona's like checking her boobs also. She needs to feed Jason. <laughs> you okay? Okay. You know the best thing actually that Ilona has when she wakes up because she lays on this side of the bed and I lay on that side of the bed. When she wakes up and she just turns to her side just this little guy laying there, yeah? Sometimes when he wakes up, he's super happy. My hand is shaky, by the way. I don't know what I did, but ah, oh, it's from, ah, oh, it's from the pressure washer. Are you having fun? Are you having fun? Ah. You're gonna get in trouble, mister. You're gonna get in trouble. Oop, yeah, boom. See, in trouble. <laughs> You got yourself stuck. And that's why you get childproof paint. <laughs> yeah, because you stick everything in your mouth now. Eh? <laughs> child safe paint, not childproof. Nothing is childproof, I think. Yeah, you learn how to get your hand back. <laughs> Difficult life, eh? Are you gonna have a fight with your pillow again? He does it sometimes. He just slams his face and in his pillow and he does like ah, rah, 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 rah. Eh? <laughs> Now you just want the camera, I guess, huh? You're not even that overexcited. A second ago, he was super overexcited. Oh, he is excited, but when he gets really excited, oh, you'll know, huh? You know, literally what I also forgot, I just remembered that I started the vlog with my Martis and I was actually about to take it off today, but um, I forgot. I forgot that when we left, I wanted to do a couple of things. There were actually three things. I wanted to go to Venetia, to like Chris Caramagnolis, to his Sagro Plastio. I wanted to go to Grusula, and I want to get rid of my thing oh no four things because i also want to wash the car the fourth thing i didn't do though but that's okay if tomorrow's a nice and sunny day eh, jason we can do it then as well no attention for the pop for, for the papa anymore hi <coughs> Look what a nice and clean car this is. Wow. Could be a little cleaner, but. This morning first, we're gonna pick up somebody here. Sorry. Tell you. Hello, Mariana. Hello. Your hair looks fabulous. Yes, of course. 
Είναι η Thank you very much. Έλα ρε εσύ, τι φέρατε πάλι! Μα είναι δυνατόν! <laughs> Θέλετε να με παχύνετε! <laughs> oh. Έχω ξεκινήσει γυμναστήρο, πρέπει να δυνατήσω, έρχεται καλοκαίρι, πρέπει να βάλω τα γιά μαμάι μαγιό, <laughs> να τα κάνω πασαρέλα, επίδειξη! She's making commercial for your mama, no! <laughs> Συγγνώμη, δεν έπρεπε. Just, just kidding, just kidding. Α, όχι, όχι. No. Uh, Θα φάμε πάλι. We want to thank Mariana for just, uh, like last moment, she could take care of Durak, so... And she walked twice actually to our house because she forgot a key. <laughs> Thanks to Vinatia. Yeah, near, near. Okay, we're gonna drive. It takes two people to get Jason dressed. <laughs> we did it. Jason, Mariana had to leave already, huh? Yeah, Mariano already had to go. We're right now at the orchestra as a vo store in Volus with baby clothes. Or it's all over the world, but we're looking for something that is a little bit less warm than the jacket he already has. And a little bit uh, warmer than like nothing, wearing like nothing like, right now. But the stuff that we all see, it's they don't have the size usually that we have. So it's a little bit difficult, huh? We saw some very cool stuff. But I still need to get rid of my marsipo, like I said. So that's the next thing that we're gonna do. I mean Martis. Marsipo is the thing that uh, Jason sits in <laughs> his mom or like hangs in his belly. Eh? Carry bag. We mean the Martis that is around my waist, my arm. My arm, not my waist. This is trousers with this. Jason, congratulations on your new jacket. Huh? Congratulations on your new jacket. Yes. We spotted Chrysula. <laughs> You're sure that it should be a rose plant, right? I don't know, that's what they say. Okay. So the story says that if you want good luck or something, is it for good luck? I have no idea. We don't know exactly the story behind it anymore, but this is a Matis, they also wear it everywhere in the Balkan. And officially, when you see the first swallow or when it gets the first of April, so when spring like literally starts, you have to take it off and you have to put it in a rose bush. And I found a rose bush. Here in the park of Elefterias. Uh, Platia uh, Elefterias, the Freedom Park. And there's actually a very nice rose in there. Beautiful. And there's more coming out, and there's one more coming out, and there's so much nice stuff. Anyway. Uh, does it come off? Oh, okay, it comes off. Thanks. You're welcome. So, uh, literally, I'm going to hang it, uh, I think I'm going to hang it on the rose. So, if you're from Volos, do not take it off, please. We're just. Yeah, okay, the swallows have to be able to take it, you say? Yeah. Is that the truth? Well, this is what they say. You think so? They, uh, they're building a nest with them, I think. Ah, they, they're supposed to build a nest. The swallows are supposed to build a nest with that. Cool. Hey, I can see Jason in your glasses, by the way. Hey, can you when see that he's falling down also? Can yeah, he's little, literally sliding down a little bit. He's eating his... Uh... Also, you know what just happened when we walked out of orchestra? I said it was going to rain, right? Yeah, I, I also have uh, good luck, I guess, because there was, I just wiped it off, but there was uh, bird poop on my arm. So that was probably like a pigeon or something that just literally pooped on me. And I checked my hair, but I don't see anything else on me, so I don't know. Anyway, this is going to be it for the vlog. If you liked it, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button, leave a comment down below. Below, because we love to read them and we always reply. Thank you for watching. I don't reply, but I like to read them. <laughs> she always reads them. <laughs> Thanks for watching, I'll see you next one. Bye.